Hello Capricorn, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your messages from Spirit Reading. This will be for August 2022 for the sign of Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So I hope you're well. Remember Capricorn, these readings won't be for everyone. So just take what resonates with you as always. So very akin to your energy because you are Earth energy. We have nature. You know, I feel this is more like doing what you do well with this card. You know, this is... You know, embracing your natural talents, your resources, your practical abilities, uh, staying grounded. You know, with, this is called nature. So this is a time to absorb the healing properties that nature has to offer. Your mind, body and soul need nourishment, energy, revitalization and strength. Nature has much to offer. So take this time to connect and spend some quality time outdoors. Could be some advice for you there. And again, take what resonates, Capricorn. These readings won't be for everybody. And they are mainly messages, so just bear that in mind. So we're going to pull a card from the Archangel Michael deck. Get a message from Archangel Michael. So what do we have that just wants to fall out? So let's go with it. We have Explore Your Options. Dear God, thank you for your wisdom and love, helping me see, understand and assess all of my alternative options. Please guide me in the best direction for my health, happiness and life's purpose. Being grounded, exploring your options. I'm going to pull you a destiny card here, Capricorn. So let's see what destiny card comes out for you for August 2022 message for our lovely capricorns for august 2022 please angel spirits guides thank you oh my goodness i have miracles isn't that lovely i'm going to read that out to you this is the double rainbow the storms of the past are passing and your dreams are coming true. No matter what has happened in the past, your future holds abounding miracles. Good fortune, celestial beauty and inner divinity are expanding within you. Believe that your life is guided. Trust in the goodness of the universe. A celestial bridge to the heavens is opening for you. Start a health program. Invest in your career or initiate a relationship and good fortune will manifest. Blessings are flowing in all directions. Believe that you deserve the best because you do. Bounty, joy, blessings and miracles are flowing your way. Well, that's lovely. So I'm going to pull you your spirit animal for August 2022. See what spirit animal comes out for you, Capricorn. Okay, what do we have for Capricorn, please? What is the spirit animal for Capricorn for August 2022? Thank you. You know, when I cut the deck of this, the boar came out, so it's come out again. <laughs> we have boar pig face your problems head on with confidence and courage and you will emerge victorious such lovely messages this feeling though of, of mother earth um, nature supporting you holding you you connecting to your own element. You know, there's a strong energy here of doing that this month because it's really beneficial for you. Uh, so however you connect to nature, it feels it, it just empowers you and supports you and helps you in some way. I'm going to pull your card, see what message we get for you, Capricorn. So what do we have for Capricorn, please? What is the message from Spirit for Capricorn for August 2022? Thank you. 
message from spirit for capricorn for august 2022 So we start with the Knight of Cups. We have the Seven of Cups, sorry, Seven of Pentacles. That's, that's that grounding energy, considering your options maybe. We have the World bottom of the deck Capricorn we have the three of swords so I am going to start with this because it is quite a, a powerful energy so there's levels to this you know the three of swords can be uh, to do with in, in relationships this can be heartbreak painful truths emotional pain third party situations, considering breakups, all of that kind of energy here. Um, it is something that tests us. So there's definitely an energy here of it could well be for some of you, you've been tested in a relationship in some way and been hurt on some level. Now this could be other areas as well. Uh, it could well be something that may have affected you in some way that's caused you hurt, disappointment, emotional pain. So however that, whatever that resonates for you. So the Knight of Cups, Capricorn. So the Knight is the Knight of Emotion, the Knight of Feelings. So this Knight is offering love. Uh, completely open and vulnerable and offering love of some kind so for some of you it might well be in this situation that this can be if someone has hurt you it might well be that there is an apology here there is somebody who wants to bring positive change by offering you love by saying I'm sorry by want by saying sorry wanting to bring positive change here um, so definitely an energy on that front here, Capricorn, if it's to do with uh, love, romance, relationships, can also be friendships or family as well. Uh, it feels in this energy here, you are just considering, you know, how you move forward. Now, the Knight of Cups can also be to do with someone offering you love in terms of support, helping you bring positive change in your life uh, by emotionally supporting you in some way. So this can be that kind of energy too. It, it is offers of love, but it can well be to help you through a difficult time. Because we have the Seven of Pentacles. So the Seven of Pentacles can be where you're reviewing your options, you're taking stock. In relationship terms, whatever this relationship is, whichever area of a relationship, this will be, you know, where you're you're evaluating, you're taking stock, you know, do I want to continue with this relationship? I've been hurt, you know, am I going to accept their offer? But however, I've got history with this person. We've built up, we've built up some level of value. We have history. We have, you know, spent some significant time, you know, together. So, or this person has been in my life for a considerable amount of time. So there's definitely an energy of, do I want to give that all up? You know, do I, what's what value is it of to you now so you might be considering that here in terms of this offer really looking at your options and considering whether you want to stay on that path make changes that can be this kind of energy as well capricorn now the seven of pentacles can also be where someone has been persevering uh persevering towards you know really bringing positive change it's very good in terms of money career finances in the sense that somebody has has really been persevering on a path and they're wondering if positive change is going to happen for them so it might well be for some of you that you're considering you know um how far you've come and how to persevere further you know uh, do you want to make changes you know am I going to get you know the 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 end goal I want you know that can be this kind of energy as well I'm really looking looking at what you've done to this point and persevered on 
Because the world card can be, I mean, in many business career terms, the world card can be victory, it can be success, it can be goal achievement, celebration. Uh, it does represent uh, material success as well. It's worldly success. So it's an energy of the reward of all your hard work and effort, you know, because it's your ruler, it's Saturn. So these energies are very Saturnian, you know, tests, challenges and perseverance. But how, how these tests and challenges teach us something, we evolve through it and claim a victory, the end goal, as a result of what we've learned and how we have faced challenges and tests and overcome them. And this is definitely an energy of overcoming some significant test. So for some of you, this is very good in terms of money, career, finances. Um, I mean, the World Cup can be victory energies on, in other areas. I mean, it can well be in terms of legal as well for some of you or, you know, whatever other victory it could be. But, you know, you understand how the energy translates here. This is somebody who has persevered toward an end goal and the end goal is being achieved here. So for some of you, it might well be someone offered you support, whether it was, you know, if you need some money, you know, while you're going through this, I'm, I'm absolutely happy to help you if you need emotional you know support help if you want to talk I'm happy to to help you if you need me to do something to help you and support you that's the energy here you understand what I'm saying so this is just absolutely getting the help and support that you need but it's very good in terms of goal achievement success and victory a testing period completes here now Certainly some of you might well be also considering completing something, ending something, if it's to do with, you know, relationships. Because this can be, do I, do we, do I accept this person's, you know, offer and we move through to a brand new phase of our lives, we move on from it, or do I end something? And this is where you're really looking at how valuable this person is to you compared to how they've hurt you and weighing that up and wondering whether you want to make changes or not. So there's an energy here, Capricorn, of take the time you need. Take the time you need. This is a very grounded, it's very factual, it's very methodical, it's very patient energy. Um, sometimes can be a bit frustrating because uh, things don't move quickly with the Seven of Pentacles. But sometimes you need that time to come to the right conclusions. So that's what I see happening for you for August 2022. So again, however it resonates for you, the lovely energy is we do have this ball, which was face your problems head on with confidence and courage and you will emerge victorious. This is the energy of whatever conclusion you come to. It's victory, it's victory for you. It's success for you because you overcome the issue or the challenge that has faced you. And that would be whether it's been, you know, frustrated at how slow things were moving and how, you, how much you've had to persevere to bring positive change or victory in your circumstances could be money career financially driven in terms of getting what you deserve getting the end goal getting the victory getting the success and for others of you is taking your time to really evaluate your options in whether you complete something or you can truly draw a line under something and step through to a new phase of your life so i feel you're taking your time if it's an offer in terms of relationships i'm going to pull in spirits advocating that explore your options so I'm going to pull an angel message for you, Capricorn. These are quite shiny cards, so they don't always scan in on camera, but we'll try. <laughs> so let's see what we have for you. What do we have for Capricorn? Message from Spirit for Capricorn, please. Thank you. Ask your inner self to answer your question. How lovely. So that's the first card for you. I'm going to pull you an angel number as well, Capricorn. Let's see what we have for you. Message for Capricorn, please, Angel Spirits Guides. And you might see this number. If this reading resonates for you, you might see this number a lot in August. So let's see what we have for Capricorn. It might mean something to you. What do we have for Capricorn, please? 
What is the number for Capricorn? Okay. 227. Take action now. Your manifestation and attraction abilities are potent at this time. Remove all barriers, moments of uncertainty and indecision. Allow yourself to be open and receptive to your well-deserved blessings. And we do have miracles here. What I'm getting with this here is Capricorn. There is a period of time where things feel quite slow, but then all of a sudden action is required. Either you're coming to the right conclusion for you or action is required towards victory and success. You know, there's response here. So again, whatever this energy is, it feels like a period of, of options and evaluations and then action here. Um, all systems go because there's lovely energies of miracles and results here. I'm going to pull you a final card, final message for Capricorn, please. And this is the message from Heaven Deck. Again, whatever heaven means to you. I just like the messages here. What do we have for Capricorn, please? Thank you. That flew out. Listen to your inner voice as we try to guide you. Use your intuition, number 21. And bottom of the deck, we have number 19. Try not to worry. We will bring helpful people into your life. So those are your messages from Spirit Capricorn for August 2022. I hope you enjoyed your reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. And I wish you a wonderful August. I will see you next time.